today we are at our second Healthy Brain, Healthy Life workshop and we are going to be exploring the creative arts. So research has shown that getting involved in art can be stimulating for the brain. It reduces stress and cortisol levels and it's really important for brain function. So we have Barbara here today and she's going to help us create different collages and our participants will be able to take these collages home with them to remind them of being part of this workshop. Today I made a collage of things, but I did it in shades of the rainbow. And it was quite funny because me and the girls at the table, we were like singing the rainbow song that we haven't sung since we were a kid and just finding the different colours that I needed and then the interesting shapes and sort of putting it all down on a, on a page. It was fun. I've made a sunset an abstract sunset okay <laughs> so <laughs> it basically represents um, a bit of hope because um, I've got some choppy waters as well and the brain can be like that a bit sometimes because we go through a lot of stuff in life don't we as long as you've got a bit of sunshine a bit of light there's always hope that you can come out the other side so yeah that's what I've been thinking about um, and making today it's really exciting to be involved in research hands-on as a student and something that will hopefully have real-world relevance. Something like collage, like the rest of the workshops, it's something practical and accessible and there's no pressure for it to be perfect, which I really like. I feel relaxed doing this and, uh, and I think I can see the, the reason why relaxation in doing things like this in artwork can help promote brain health and I think it's, it's been a good exercise so far. I think it really benefits brain health, you know, you've got a vision in your mind that you want to try and replicate down on paper, so you're actively using your brain to seek the things that you can recreate your image with, or your vision. So yeah, I can definitely feel the synapses firing up for sure. <laughs> I think that it's best that we relate through something that we can do with our hands so we don't have to overthink because if we just sit and we think about our own personal problems through the mind then it's just not going to come out properly and it's going to affect the mental health so I think the best way is to put it into something and crafts is just the best way to express yourself. It's been really good to hear other people's stories as well and everyone's been talking about how therapeutic they're finding it as well and um, I think it's just been really calming today getting to you know jog our creative sides of our brain so that's been really good. This workshop was really fun and it was awesome to see the fantastic creations and although um, it was way out of our comfort zone for me and for some of the participants, it was really lovely to see the nice work that we've created and um, that we'll be taking home with them. Mm -hmm.